You have an eye for design. I absolutely love it. Thank you. <laughs> Honestly, when Mom said you were converting the barn to a loft, I couldn't see it. But it's beautiful. Job well done. I'm glad you like it. And I totally appreciate your letting us move in. What? Ren and I are staying in the barn while we redo my place in the city. No, I'm moving in for junior year, Melissa. Th that's the deal that I made with Mom and Dad. I got the grades, I did the internship, I gave up my summer because I wanted this. Well, you'll just have to wait. Why can't you stay in my room? We're a couple, Spencer. We need our own space and Mom and Dad agree. But they promised me. <laughs> Is everything okay? I'm Ren. I was hoping you'd be happy for me. Well, you know what they say about hope. Breeds eternal misery. Sounds like she was counting on moving into the barn. Don't worry about Spencer. She'll get over it. Hi, low anyone? Hi, low. It's a game. You guys don't play it in bed. Ren, you can play too. I'm a bit lost. <laughs> You'll catch up. I'll go first. We just started our first week at class, and I've already been nominated to serve on the business school's leadership committee. <laughs> <laughs> Melissa likes to play the game when she's fairly certain she'll win. <laughs> well, guess who I learned that from? Yes, but don't go tasting victory just yet. Because the judge ruled on my brief today. The class action suit against Winslow has been dismissed. Oh. <laughs> if I don't play the way, I'll get another uh. drink. Spencer, you're up. Um. I'll go. I got a brilliant parking spot today, right in front of the chem lab. <laughs> <laughs> He's just kidding. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dad, he left for the office. Already? So he ran without me? Why didn't he just knock on my door? He was busy. He was helping Melissa dispose of some things that Ren left behind. Unfortunately, you weren't one of them. How many times am I going to have to say it? Oh, girls, please. I can't arbitrate at one cup of coffee. But who's calling the paper to pull the announcement? It was hard enough changing my status on Facebook. I'll take care of the newspaper. Oh, what about the engagement dinner? Do I have to make that call? No, honey, of course not. Just look up the number and I'll leave a message. Where are you going? I'll eat in my bedroom. Oh, no, you won't. I just dry cleaned your bedspread. Sit at the table. I don't think I'm welcomed. That's never stopped you before. I did not invite your fiancé to kiss me, Melissa. For the last time, he made the move on me. Oh, Spencer, Right, please. and you just sat there like a throw pillow with your tongue down his throat. Look, I get it. You're upset, and I feel for you. But, but don't dump it all on me. Maybe you should be asking yourself why Ren felt the need to... I'm sorry. Okay, I'm not perfect. But I don't want to be accused of something oh, that I didn't do. Please, both of you, go get dressed for school. You can take your muffin to go. Hey. Hi, how was the club? Chilly. Nobody who works there can figure out a thermostat. Did you eat? Yeah, I made some pasta if you're hungry. I'm not eating pasta. I don't need to be depressed and fat. Good point. I'll make a salad. Let me get out of these clothes. Ren called. He told me you went into the city yesterday to meet him. It was strange. At first, I wasn't sure why he was telling me this. But then I realized he's still trying to cover his tracks and yours. Like, I'm supposed to believe you took a train down there just to clear your name? You two deserve each other. I thought I was pathetic. 
What are you doing here? I was asked. The alumni has a former homecoming queen present the crown. Right, and this year it's some chick from the class of 2000. I'm filling in. Apparently she's been vomiting since Thursday. <laughs> Great. Oh, by the way, they posted the winning Golden Orchid essays online, and I had a chance to read yours. Or should I say mine? Look, I've already told Mom and Dad, and they think a retraction would be more of an embarrassment for us. It's a really stupid thing to do, and I'm so sorry. No, you're not. You never are. Oh my gosh, Melissa! Hey, Trish. Hi, I'm Melissa, Spencer's sister. Alex, nice to meet you. We've met at the club. Are you on the homecoming committee as well? Alex doesn't go here. He goes to school across town. Where do you go? PS 187 on Elmhurst. You, know, you wouldn't have heard of it, Melissa. It's not the same zip code as the Prada outlet. Um, um, catering crisis. 